Oh, see, this one isn't so bad. This one doesn't scare me as much as humans, even though it's bad being 150 TV down, obviously, because they've got more. Much rather be 150 TV up than 150 TV down. At least they didn't start with block, so he's paying a lot of TV for block. Um, and also, strength 4 on the blitzers do, doesn't do anything for him when it comes to hitting things. So yeah, all he's got is about as much block as that human team had. Um, Alright, what's he got? He's got a 50-50 record. He's got an edge up passing accurate beast man. <laughs> he does have a claw mighty blow warrior, which obviously could tear through the ogres, which sucks. But he's only got 11 men. He's got a shitty go, which is fantastic. He's got a shitty go there. And he's got Tarfago. So. Um. Yeah, alright, so I guess just a wizard then. I guess that, that could that could do something. I hate Nobla, I hate I hate um I hate secret weapons. Hello bleeding hippie. Um football's pretty fun, five and all with ogres, despite playing two dwarf teams. And down TV most games. Pretty amazing. Alright, just need to win the coin toss receive and then hopefully make him concede. <laughs> Yeah, single core player rip ogres. That's the sad truth, isn't it? Though you can just two dice every turn and, and wreck us. Claw block claw mighty blow is just brutal. So the ogres need to somehow make it hard for them to get a two dice on. Them. But I don't really want him to three dice a... Oh, he's got tackle as well, what the fuck? I really don't want him to three dice a snotling, but it's better than him two dicing an ogre, isn't it, I guess? At the end of the day. Doesn't have a guard. Of course, here he can't even one dice him. Seems to get blitzed anyway. Guard block, break tackle. Yeah, control. Yeah, very important. To that, that should be. A lot. So you can one dice. Oh no, you can't because I've got guard. So this this might be all right actually. They are fun. Um, when I say I hate them, I mean in terms of effectiveness. Because they're. Uh, Because they're just they're just risky, aren't they? They're dicey and you know. Yeah, I need a whiz to steal and score with a plus movement novel, which is the star of the team, yeah. Um Yeah, it, it looks like he can't take blocks though, doesn't it? I mean how does he make blocks here? You'd have to minus two dice, so. 
No, it's Beast Man that's gone. I'm like, Chaos Guy. He'd have to start it. He'd have to start his turn with like a minus 2D on the guard guy, then a 1D on an ogre. Which is um, not great, is it? Need Nos now. Yeah. yeah, getting three dice by block and tackle was the uh, was the price for not nobody getting an organ not getting too deep by claw mighty blow on the block, wasn't it? Yeah, the weapon stars, if you've got the Nuffle Altar, you get them really cheap, yeah. Yeah, really cheap. Hathark used to be... Used to be good, didn't he? Whereas now he is sadly only decent. <laughs> yeah, maybe he will. Maybe he will. I just got to hit this claw guy, haven't I? And then keep him, keep him dominated. Ah, oh, so he's he's put men on the line, but then can't block with them. That's interesting, isn't it? Hello, the Sarovak. Yeah, it's a clear madness in his method. <laughs> Can't get to the... Uh, well, I could have a powered... I've got to hit the tackler anyway, haven't I, realistically? So yeah, so he's... I guess in, in one way he's occupying these. But... I can hit the ball here, can't I? If I'm lucky. God, block. Block doing something instantly. Come on. Yes. Alright. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. One, two, three, four, five. That was G it's a GFI to hit him, isn't it? But it's not like I can't go for it. Didn't even bonehead. Unbelievable. Oh, you cunt. All right. Reroll's gone. Ah, oh, you fucking piece of shit. <gasps> I was I freed up this guy and blitz with somebody else. I fucking made those blocks so I wouldn't have to make the GFI. How bad is that? How absolutely fucking bad is that? Oh holy shit. That's literally why I made those two blocks. And then made a GFI. For no reason. Oh, man. Oh, fuck about. Fuck. Fuck, there's my reroll gone on a roll I didn't need to make. There you go. Fucking shit. Fucking shit play. For base him, you can one dice him. Can't really two dice him though. Ah, there you go. I'm boneheaded with that one anyway. So, so let let's let's call it a wash. <laughs> I 
And now I fucking blocked a free emote. Didn't know. What a fucking idiot. Oh, man. That's the sort of mistake that you just can't make with ogres. To win with ogres, you literally have to play a flawless game. And then, uh, and get lucky. <laughs> and then that was not flawless. It was not flawless or lucky. Man, I made those blocks to free him up. What was I playing at? Oh, he's giving us an interception attempt. He deserved for that to be intercepted, didn't he? That was, uh, I mean, that was just strictly worse there. Because he could have made the 2 plus dodge. He could re roll that, whereas I. Oh no, he didn't have a re roll anymore. Okay, fair enough, he didn't have the re roll anymore. So it wasn't that bad, actually. It wasn't that bad. Because he'd used his re roll. Fair enough. Hey, of course. Of course, mate. Of course. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off. Right. Um... I haven't got a reroll. I don't want to use a wizard. Might have to use the wizard. I don't want to 2D the ball, I want to 3D the ball. It's not easy though, is it? Ball is based at least. I guess I want to. Uh, want to give give up a guy to get fucking tackled. He could go there and then he could come in there. a shit turn in the end. Maybe I shouldn't have. Maybe I shouldn't have activated him after failing his. But I really wanted to three dice him and then get the ogre in there and then it's not, it's, he can't just one dice me away, can he? Giving up three dice block tackle hits aren't good, are they? A little train of pain. Gone surprisingly well for ogres, to be honest. 
got the break tackle in the wrong place. I have to bolt in this turn. Only two dice? That's pretty good, isn't it? And then he, he, got, he got cast. Well, KO. One, two, three, four, five, double GFI. Oh, that's crap in it. Got a bolt then. Got a bolt. This has gone shit, and it's all because I—it's all because I wasted that fucking reroll, isn't it? Um. All right, so that takes care of him. means he could then three dice him and get in the way or he could just do he could just go come around here for an assist and then he could three dice safe with one two three four five so there's just no way to keep the balls maybe I shouldn't have wizard wizarded ball is based he can stand in and hit the claw, the tackle guy at least. No IV work. Maybe he just dodges, eh? But then what does he even fucking do? Not a lot. Hand off to him and then it's hard for him to get two dice on him. Two TZs. Hello, Rocks Ash. I, I don't even know what that means, to be honest. <laughs> ah, yes, of course. Well, you didn't even lose power. Right, yeah, I've just got it now. Fucking hell. I'm stupid, aren't I? I was thinking it was some kind of, uh, <laughs> some kind of Dragon Ball Z thing, because they all talk about their power level over 9,000, so I was thinking there's something to do that, but yes, well done. Good. Good news. Oh, fuck off! Is there any need for this? This is the game that I lose with Olgas, really. Like, really, this is the game that I lose. Nerves of Steel, Beast Men, is what I lose to. Crazy. Fucking Nerves of Steel, Beast Men. Maybe I should have gone for the Bray Tackle just so we'd be here to blitz him this turn.
That's good enough, isn't it? Two assists. <laughs> oh, got him. Keeps him based up as well, doesn't it, on the ground? And I guess I don't even make this block because he could bonehead here is pretty bad, I think. So ah shit, roll the one. Yeah, I played 16 games with Ogres on Fumble in a row with one team. I've like I've played more than 16 overall on Fumble, but uh, after they were this bad, I played a few games with them when they were better. He's just teeing off now, isn't he? <laughs> just teeing off now with it. It's Claw Mighty Blow. Claw Mighty Blow just kills Ogres as a team. That's the thing. That's the really bad thing about them, I guess. I played when I played my sixteen games with Ogres. I played Necro a few times, and it was just, it was just a nightmare because there's nothing, there's nothing you can do, you know. Didn't go for the six plus pickle. Unbelievable, Jeff. Guess I blitz him. And block him. There you go. That and them being utter shit. I play to win. Self claw my e blowed. It's fucking horrible, isn't it? It's just horrible. Now he's gonna score. Ogres are the worst, Stapa Wolfie. Ogres are the worst. Goblins are the best. Then halflings, then ogres. Ogres are the worst team in Blood Bowl. Yeah, he could have still failed. I mean, it's, it's only Claw Mighty Blow. It's not Claw Palm. Like he's, he's actually broken. He's broken more armor with him than he has. He's knocked over loads of snots. He's actually broken armor more on with his Claw Mighty Blow than he has on on snotlings, on Noblars, whatever you want to call them. Could have scattered the ball, but I don't think him a free pickup. He's actually might not score here. Shouldn't have got my fucking hopes up, should I? He hasn't failed any ball rolls. Like, what the fuck, man? He's just picking up in tackle zones, dodging out every time. So he's got to push him back. So... Haha. <laughs> Get banged on. Oh no, this guy's in range though. Shit.
Oh, that was that was a bit of a fucking stupid thing to do, wasn't it? Oh, he's got I've got a GFI and base him now. And not get claw pond. Well, it's claw mighty blow, isn't it? Could one dice him, I guess. But a push means I just get claw pond anyway, so claw mighty blow. Well, yeah, lizards aren't really a stunny team, are they? Yeah, there wasn't a lot I could do, was there? Side step next to the side. Oh, yeah, pushed them to there. Yeah, that's what I should have done. Absolutely. Absolutely should have pushed him to there, yeah. If, if I, like I would have done, had I realised he had him here as well. But I just thought he was the furthest one forward, so I th just thought pushing him back was enough. But obviously it wasn't. So there you go, misplay. Misplaying as ogres means a loss at the end of the day. Maybe he'll fail a ball action. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. As if that could fucking happen. <laughs> wow, yeah, so if, if I'd realised he had the other guy, I would have pushed him against the sideline, yeah. But, um... He hasn't failed any 3-4s or 5s, no. No. He is ball Jesus. <laughs> Absolutely, he is ball Jesus. Fuck, man. It's funny how sad I am about <laughs> about somebody scoring on their offensive drive. It shouldn't be something. You, you know, you should expect it, shouldn't you, as August? But uh, <laughs> I'm actually pretty sad that he scored on his own drive. That's crazy, isn't it? Right. What the fuck am I doing here? I guess there's some kind of optimal formation to fucking set up for the one turn. Don't know what it is. Do I get the chance of a one turn? No, I get an ogre claw mighty blowed. <laughs> I was thinking this is great, he's left him blitzable. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, the first thing I was going to do was blitz his claw mighty blow and then think about scoring the one turn. But oh no, get blitzed by mighty blow instead. Mighty blow claw. Fucking hell. Ah, good. Fuck you. Hope he dies. Hope he fucking dies. No. Um. Right. I mean, a two dice block here is uh, is dumb. I guess I can do a two dice with block. Uh. <laughs> I'm really tempted to just two dice him just because he's got block and tackle. 
Because the odds of the touchdown working are so low. Nah, fuck it, i got to go for it, haven't I? <laughs> yeah. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant, eh? Brilliant. Brilliant. Tackle zone's throwing effect it, which is why I was blitzing him to clear the uh, to clear the tackle zone. <laughs> yeah, John. Yeah. Well, there you go. Now I've got the four, the fabled four ogre start, and it's it's not good. <laughs> it's not it's not good having four ogres. I'll tell you now, four ogres is is not good. It's actually shit having four ogres. But four, six, seven, ten, ten players. Really, only ten players. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, eleven. Six, ten, eleven. Yeah. And he's got three, six, three, six, nine, ten. So one player up. What a shit, what a shit thing to have happen instead of a glorious throw teammate touchdown. Right, so two dicing, oh it's three dicing, yeah obviously. Three dicing him is better, oh, of course not. Right, so now two dicing him is better. Glorious. Thank you very much, Bucket Bong, for subscribing to Twitch Prime. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Glorious. <laughs> All right. Couldn't fucking knock him over though. Yeah, exactly. Ogres aren't a team to be conservative with. No. Well, I mean, I play them still very... Four Ogres solve any TV issues. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true, yeah. But it also solves being able to have any kind of strength advantage whatsoever, doesn't it? I was honestly thinking not going any, any re-rolls, just because it is... So much TV. Ah, there you go. Of course. Why wouldn't it be an instant removal? Yeah, well done. Well done, buddy. Just getting all played hard here. <laughs> getting all played hard. <laughs> yeah, exactly with four augers. Yeah, just play Camry and have a real team. Glorious. Oh, glorious.
Glorious. Thank you very much, Kalestein. Um, thank you very much, and welcome to Team Fantastic. Ah, oh, yeah. Thank you very much. I'm getting pissed off with this, uh, with this Chaos Warrior. But uh, thank you very much, guys, for the subs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It just it's just sad, isn't it, to beat oh to beat dwarves. Well, I mean I guess I know they were they weren't proper fucking games against the dwarves. But still, to have beaten dwarves twice with this team, and then this is the this is the game that they lose. Beating the humans two hundred and fifty T V down and stuff. And Yeah, exactly. Don't ever play against someone that's in claw. Yeah, yeah, it is. You know that. That's the thing. On fumble, it's not so bad because you play an equal TV. But on blood ball two, you're down TV so much. Claw mighty blow just absolutely wrecks you. He's just broken armor. Every, he's powered every hit and broken armor every hit. Every single hit has been a powered armor, apart from the first one and the double score. Wow. Yeah, don't roll it. Don't roll a triple both down into death instead of scoring you one turn on your skilled up guy as well. Wow. <sighs> You <laughs> can play Blood Bowl before I know, right? Right, can blitz him. Easy. Have to reroll. GFI. Oh, I should have gone forward. Idiot. Idiot. See you later, con. No. 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 And he gets the ball. He gets the ball right back to his team. Brilliant. 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 Couldn't have gone better. <laughs> yeah, see you later, gun. <laughs> uh, and the ogre could have been one square forward, so there you go. Misplay, brutally punished. Deserved. Deserved failure. Yeah, that's the thing. I was just it was just a misclick. I I don't know how it happened. So yeah. Yeah, that was it, absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, see you there, Gun. It was great, that wasn't it. <sighs> I just thought, you know, if I had some positive mental energy for one time, PMA, positive mental attitude, I thought, you know, if I say see you later, instead of just saying, oh, please, please don't roll a one, if I just say, ah, I'll score, it'll work like Kanor when he says, I'm just going to surf this guy. But it didn't. But yeah, that was it. That was a complete misplay. It should have been one square forward and it would have been a touchdown. So, so no excuse, you know, that's, that's it, isn't it? No excuse, misplay. Not even the dice. Although there was no need for it to be a one with a perfect throw in, but still. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly, Sean. Yeah. 
Yeah, the Brogues are done now, I think. With having him killed, like, he's not going to concede this game, so won't have money to replace him, so... Still, it was a good, it was a good run for the Brogues. Kilaji man, he might concede. Yeah, okay, that's that's actually a fair fair comment. Fair comment. <sighs> now I could have thrown him thrown him at the cage, but no. Yeah, that should have been the play. He made a throw at the, at the end of his turn, his as uh, some his move or something. Should have moved him first, then he should have gone back there and thrown him. But it was too late then. But yeah, there you go. It, it, so there you go. I mean, that was it. It was like Lizardmen, wasn't it? Lizardmen. Once you go down Saurus, it gets harder and harder, and that's that's what it's like with ogres. Which is why I think the uh, the four ogre start is just nonsensical. Yep, yep, exactly. There you go. And this is yep, two misplays, two, two, two pure mis misplays. Even though he rolled crazy dice, didn't fail a pickup, didn't fail the GFIs, he didn't fail anything on his score. And I rolled a triple skull into death on setting up the throw. There were two brutal misplays. One ate a re-roll, and the other one uh, stopped a touchdown. So yeah, just absolute misplays cost us. I didn't know for I didn't even Oh you should check if people have enough altar, shouldn't you? I didn't know he had that. I could have benefited from that. He's used dodge. Do I just go for the th the four plus for a three D while still keeping him based? I'm losing one nil, so I've got to do something, haven't I? There's a 3D there, then a recovery, I guess. This is low risk. Low risk, zero reward. But still, it's low risk. You need the assist there, don't you? you need it so you can't get two dice on it.
Yeah. Well said. <laughs> well said, VIP Mr. Yemen there. And this is this is a great argument for why halflings don't really want to be down TV because if they are, your opponents get block and tackle and mighty blow and your team looks pretty horrible, doesn't it? Can't get the assist in now, can he? What's his plan this turn? It was to power the snotling, wasn't it? And he failed at it, thank God. Well, the first one he failed in. I think his plan was to kill, to power this snotling and then blitz for that and one dice there. Yeah, exactly, even just blitz with block and snots, yeah. They ruin, um, they ruin ogres and shit enough though, don't they? Uh, not ogres, what's it called? It's goblins and halflings, enough. But yeah, <laughs> blitzes with just block ruin slots, yeah, that, that's the thing. It ruins snots. It hurts goblins and halflings, but it fucking ruins snots. Right, come on. Wow, got him. Bang on. Oh man. All right. See you later, cunt. <laughs> um. Bad. I don't hate it. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> yep, kill another auger, you fuckhead. Stun was huge as well, wasn't it? Because now everyone else can just run away. Yeah, not a bad turn. <laughs> as as things have, as things go. Two Stop in it for him. Fucking fighting everything. Ah! Block. Wow! Didn't kill him. He's gonna. He's not. He didn't re-roll it. Wow. Just got to roll a bunch of two pluses now, eh? With uh, with dodge. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And two dodges for him. One, two, three, four, five, six. And he goes one, two, three, four, five. And then he goes one, two, three, four, five. I don't hate it, to be honest. And then he, like, he blitzes and then he bases him or something. Alright. <laughs> Double one. <laughs> oh, fuck off. <sighs> ah, shit. Go on, re-roll it, you asshole. Stop fucking fighting everything! Ah! Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, that's true, but Master X, that's true. It is good it is good for that reason to be fair. Playing playing ogres is good for that reason because then you have got to play like every every action, like you know, like you've got no rerolls, obviously, because you don't have rerolls when you start with six ogres. So you've got to like plan for failure and stuff and make sure everything's right even though it wasn't right. Um he should have uh, bought down there, shouldn't he? In score, push this into scoring range there. Of course, he's not going to fail anything to do with the ball, so he, he shouldn't have worried about that, but still. Yeah, see you later, cunt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But. Yeah, well, thank you. It was it was good. It could have been better though, couldn't it? That was the thing. Ultimately, it was my misplaces is what cost us. So. I just want to take the skull, but it's not, I've got block. <laughs> and it was close. It was still close, wasn't it? I mean, it was close. One hundred and fifty TV down against chaos. <laughs> Admittedly, he had a stupid bloke goat, and he wasn't, uh, you know, he made some questionable decisions, like giving us an, a two dice on the ball that I moved the wrong fucking player. So ultimately, it was my mistakes that cost us. But having said that, I do feel pretty hard done by on the dice as well. Four wins to be the second but <laughs> Yeah, kids level a rough start, yeah, that's true. I'm not a fan of I'm not a fan of Kislev, really. I'm not I'm not a fan of these teams where you start off crap but get good eventually, which is what chaos is, isn't it really? Or like theoretically a high T V like high elves that just never get better. Like at least Chaos do get to high T V. Whereas Kislev and, and High Elves, it's a fucking long old road. Long old road for Chaos or Kislev to get to High TV. See, 70k, so that's another two or three games down an ogre. It's just, it's just bollocks, isn't it? But, um... 77 dodges, probably a, a, a unlucky, I guess. Boneheads were very well behaved ogres. Gone for it were bad. Mm. Block dice. They actually become worse at high TV on that all. Um like at high TV. But yeah, obviously mid TV they get better. But yeah, they're never crap. Well, necro, necro are similar. They're never crap, but then they're like they don't start amazing. Obvious, obviously. All right, he's dead. But yeah, it's just it's just crap now, isn't it? Five ogres. It's like next game they'll have five. They probably won't win, so they'll be five. So it's two more games with five ogres minimum, probably. Maybe three games with five ogres. And then in those games, you might have another... I like how as soon as I got an apple, an ogre died. Um, but there you go, anyway. It's not so bad, is it? Not so bad. I could still... It's still 1-5 loss 1 with the worst team in the game, so... Can't argue with that. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.